हेलो गाइज हाउ आर यू होप सो ऑल ऑफ यू ऑफ फाइन आर यू एन्जॉइंग दिस वीडियोज एस अफकोर्स एस यू शुड एन्जॉय इट टूडेज वीडियो वी आर डीलिंग विथ वन पॉइंट फोर पॉइंट थ्री इंट्रागेटिव सेंटेंस इट्स डेफिनेशन इट्स स्ट्रक्चर एंड इट्स कन्वर्जन ओके बिफोर दैट we discuss imperative sentence we discuss imperative sentence how to interchange it how to change it from one types to another type also we discuss the course outcomes as well as examination point of view it will be asked for question number 6c for 2 marks or yeah, maximum 4 marks okay change the sentence as per the direction okay we discuss the four types of sentences in english one that is called assertive sentence having the structure subject plus verb plus object yeah complement second interrogative sentence yeah questions today we are discussing the same things there are two types of interrogative sentence wh questions and second verbal questions wh question means wh words plus modal auxiliaries plus subject plus verb plus object yeah complement what is difference here we divided verb by subject we divided verb by subject means wh word plus modal auxiliary then subject then main verb then object a complement and concluded by question marks in verbal questions modal auxiliaries plus subject plus verb plus object a complement there is no wh word that's why it is called verbal question its answer always in the form of yes or no that is called modal auxiliaries plus subject plus verb plus object a yeah, complement sentence number 3 imperative sentence we already discussed it sub verb plus object a yeah, complement okay in the form of verb and object a yeah, complement subject are omitted because subject is present in the form of listener in the form of receiver and imperative sentence are nothing but it is a request suggestion advice pardon acknowledgement order etc sentence number 4 exclamatory sentence exclamatory means for our deep feelings and emotion it start with what a how then object a complement then subject plus verb and exclamation marks or interjection word plus exclamation marks plus subject plus verb plus object a complement these are the four type of sentences today's lecture we are today's video we are discussing about sentence number 3 that is called interrogative sentence okay we discuss the assertive sentence also second imperative sentence also now interrogative interrogative means definition structure and conversion these are the three things we are discussing in this video interrogative interrogation means asking something wanting some information collecting some information seeking for information that's why we interrogate some someone that is called interrogative means asking question an interrogative sentence definition look at this definition an interrogative sentence is a type of sentence that asks a question assertive sentence means facts statement declaration okay yeah assurance what is assertive sentence it gives us fact it gives us declaration assertion yeah some facts imperative sentence means nothing but request order advice suggestion pardon here is ask a question it is simple assertive means assertion fact statement declaration imperative means advice request order command suggestion interrogation means ask a question an interrogative sentence is a type of sentence that ask a question they are typically marked by inversion of the subject and predicate subject plus predicate that is the first verb is in a verb phrase appear before the subject means 
first verb is appear it is before the subject and main verb is after the subject subject divided model auxiliaries and main verb model is model auxiliaries are before the subject and main verb is a after the subject the sentence always end with a question mark this is a feature of questions it is concluded it is ended by question mark okay have you got it assertion fact statement declaration request advice command suggestion ordered pardon imperative and he is ask a question that is a interrogative definition clear one structure subject plus verb plus object a complement it is a assertive verb plus object a complement it is a imperative and here wh question then model auxiliary then subject then verb then object a con complement and last question mark have you got it yeah model auxiliaries plus subject plus verb plus object a complement and question marks what is difference here subject appear subject appear before and after of the verb means there is a dividation subject divided model auxiliaries and main verb okay for example why why means wh question why don't don't it is model auxiliary many people subject follow verb traffic rules object question mark why it is wh word don't it is a model auxiliary is in negative many people it is a subject follow main verb traffic rules it is a object and question marks means wh word plus model auxiliary is plus subject plus verb plus object and question mark this is a structure of interrogative sentence we discussed another sentences here 1.4.3 sample exercise transform the following interrogative sentence to assertive one first got it i repeat assertive also imperative also interrogative also here is interrogative did you pay the bill did model auxiliary verbal question say yes no type of question say did you pay the bill you paid the bill yeah you didn't pay the bill aisa bhi aa sakta hai the same answer did you pay the bill did means model auxiliary you means subject pay main verb the bill object question mark you paid the bill yeah you didn't pay the bill second are you ready to leave are model auxiliary you subject ready verb to leave it is a object you are ready to leave yeah you are not ready to leave okay see who doesn't know him who wh questions doesn't model auxiliaries know him him it is a object no verb who means subject everybody knows him who doesn't know him everybody knows him full stop in this way we change interrogative sentence into the assertive sentence for example here is some exercise sample exercise convert the following assertive sentence to interrogative convert the following assertive sentence to interrogative same things d he will never learn manner he will assertive to interrogative he will never learn manner will he ever learn manner will matlab kya kiya humne will model auxiliary first then subject he never means he ever learn manner these workers are not going on strike these workers are not going on strike aren't the worker going on strike aren't okay aren't these workers going on strike next f the production unit was equipped with latest machineries the production unit subject a was equipped was model auxiliaries helping verb equipped main verb with latest machineries object is was same model as was the production unit subject equipped with latest machinery 
या वाजंट द प्रोडक्शन यूनिट इक्विप्ड विथ लेटेस्ट मशीनरी इस प्रकार हम इन दिस वे वी आर कन्वर्ट मे बी इंट्रागेटिव टू असर्टिव या असर्टिव टू इंट्रागेटिव सेंटेंसेस सब्जेक्ट प्लस वर्ब प्लस ऑब्जेक्ट या कॉम्प्लीमेंट इट इज असर्टिव सेंटेंस डब्ल्यू एच वर्ड प्लस हेल्पिंग वर्ब या मॉडल एक्सलरीज प्लस सब्जेक्ट प्लस वर्ब प्लस ऑब्जेक्ट या कॉम्प्लीमेंट एंड क्वेश्चन मार्क इट इज अ इंट्रोगेटिव सेंटेंस असर्टिव मीन्स असर्शन डिक्लेरेशन स्टेटमेंट फैक्ट एंड इंट्रोगेटिव मीन्स आस्किंग अ क्वेश्चन In assertive sentence, at the end of assertive sentence we put full stop. At the end of interrogative sentence we put question mark. Very good. Hope you can understand it. Next video we are discussing one point four point four. That is exclamatory sentence. Exclamation, sudden feelings and emotion. Emotion. Exclamation means emotions. Deep feelings. okay the sentence which express deep feelings and emotion may be joy may be happiness may be grief may be sadness may be sorrow such type of sentences called exclamatory sentence we will discuss the same things in the form of definition structure and conversion okay hope you can understand it hope you can understand it